Oh, hell yes, people. We're doing this review Ash Williams style. Welcome to the Lockwood 300. Hey everyone, Mr. L here, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Lockwood 300 in Modern Warfare Zombies. Or as I'm going to call it from now on, the Olympia. Um, actually, it's not the Olympia, it's actually called the Satori 725! Yeah, yeah, whatever. To me, it's the Olympia, and that's what I'll call it. Alright? Anyway, moving on. Unlocked at level 36 in Modern Warfare 2, the Lockwood- Oh, sorry. The Olympia is a Modern Warfare 2 double barrel shotgun that comes with a fire rate of 171.4 RPM. It comes with two shells in the barrel and comes with 34 rounds in reserve when you start off in the game and goes up to a maximum capacity of 60 rounds in reserve. Since it is a double barrel shotgun, there are no extended mag options for the Olympia. Two shells is all you get. Groovy. The reload speeds on the Olympia aren't that great, clocking in at 3.1 seconds when partially empty and 3.6 seconds when the barrel is empty. Due to it being a double barrel shotgun, you're going to be constantly reloading which isn't convenient by any means and is going to be super annoying to deal with when you're surrounded by zombies. That's why, no matter what, buy Speed Cola immediately. You got that? <laughs> the Olympia has pretty solid iron sights. They're clean and efficient to use in the zombies just so you can line up your shots much better. While the Olympia is great for aiming down sights, I can't say the same for the gun while it's in tack stance. I don't want to come off as brash, but why would you use tack stance on the Olympia? Seriously, firing both shots from the hip is much better than using tack stance. I don't know, on the Olympia, tax stance isn't anything special. When it comes to the regular hordes of zombies, the Olympia has some pretty strong shots. It ain't no crowd finisher, but the shots in the Olympia are so strong that it's capable of killing a single zombie with one shot. I know for the viewers watching, you're probably like, well, no fucking shit, it's a shotgun, it's supposed to kill zombies in one shot. Well, not the shotguns of MWZ, as most of them are quite horrendous. In the Olympia's case, while it can one-shot zombies in Tier 1, it struggles to one or two-shot zombies in the Tier 2 zone, even with Legendary Aether Tool, which is due to the heavy and light-armored zombies taking a little bit more to kill, not to mention the Olympia does struggle to kill special enemies in the low and medium threat zones, which is... kinda bad. But don't worry, let's talk about how the Olympia is when it's thrown in the Pack-a-Punch. When you put the Flint Lockwood 300 in the pack punch, you get the Unlockwood. But am I gonna call it the Unlockwood? Fuck no, I'm calling this the Boomstick. This is my Boomstick! The Boomstick now comes with 4 shells in the barrel and 90 in reserve. The gun now becomes a 2 round burst and you'll now come with stronger shots to deal against the zombies and the special and elite enemies. By the way, the 2 round burst may sound off-putting at first, but think of it like this. If the first shot doesn't kill the zombie, the second shot will. While the boomstick is pretty strong and decent to use against the zombies, it has a bunch of flaws with it that can easily be fixed. Now before we move on to our next section, you're going to need someone to show you the right attachments to equip on the Olympia to make it the all-powerful boomstick you know and love. And that someone is me. For your first attachment, I recommend equipping the 11-inch Bryson Special Barrel. As you're not hunting deer or boar with the Olympia, you're hunting deadites and zombies. Have the sawed-off barrel on the gun to increase your mobility. For your muzzle, I recommend the Bryson Series 11 Choke, as this will give you a better hip fire spread along with a tighter pellet spread as well. For your stock, equip the Heist Stock mod, as this will remove the stock in the Olympia, but in turn will boost your movement and sprint to fire speed, which in turn will be great for barrel stuffing them zombies on the run. For your guard, equip the Bryson Natural Series Handguard for better flinch resistance and better gun kick and recoil control. And lastly, for your ammunition, equip the Dragon's Breath Rounds, as this will not only remind you of the Hades of old, but this will single-handedly make your shots even stronger up close against all enemies. Once all these attachments are equipped on the Olympia, you'll be kicking ass with this boomstick. Seriously, just look how beautiful this is. Not that bad looking, right? Anyway, let's move on. In the end, the Olympia and MWZ is a lot of fun to use. It's surprisingly strong against the regular zombies, and with the right attachments equipped, this thing will deal even more damage against the zombies and the special enemies. Seriously, this kitted out boomstick will make you feel like you are Ash Williams. When pack punched, the Hades will give you more ammo and stronger shots to deal against the undead in the high threat zone, and will help you take down the special and elite enemies much more efficiently. Oh, who the fuck am I kidding? I love this weapon and I can't recommend it more than enough. I beg of you guys to use the Olympia in Modern Warfare Zombies. This shotgun kicks mountains of ass and you can't go wrong with this awesome boomstick. 
Well, that wraps up this review. I hope everyone enjoyed my review of the Olympia, and join me next time where I'll be covering the Ram 9. Surprised.